Welcome to Match Fishing Masterclass. You join me today to have a look at a brand new product that I've just got, and that's the Vespi side pullers. So, like many people, I use a pole that doesn't have side pullers on, on the match kits. However, Vespi do a product that enable you to put side pullers into your match kits. You can buy power kits which 90% of the time will have um, side pullers in with a reinforced wrap on. But what this product is, it's an industrial strength like plastic tube and then it's got a PTFE bush that goes in at like a 30 degree angle which doesn't create any friction. Whereas normally you've got the bush that goes in at like 45 degrees or 90 degrees, whatever angle it is, and it causes the, the reaction to friction at the bottom. But I've got some of these, I've, I've, fitted, I've fitted a few, and I've been absolutely blown away. So I just thought I'd do a video to, to show you how easy it is to fit them. And there's no putting wrap, uh, carbon wraps on or sending your kits away. It's literally a couple of simple steps and it's job done. I've done one here, um, but I'll just take you through now how easy it is to, to do one. So all you're going to need is a drill, which is going to make it a bit easier. Vespi supply the, the drill bit. It's a six mil drill bit, um, as the hole in these is six mil. And then this is the product that you, you normally have to use with these, it gets away, gets rid of these. So, I'm just gonna take my kit now. The first thing I'm gonna do is just open it up. Okay, you've got the bung here, but you've got the, the bush going through, through the middle. All I'm gonna do is put my little finger into the hole and just push that, that PTFE bush out. Just give it a little wiggle and it'll pop out. And then what you're left is a little black recess at the top. Again, just pull, pull that out. And you're left with the industrial piece of plastic. All you're gonna do, if you've got a bit of OCD like me, just make sure the Vespi sign's the right way around and then slide it over the thin end of your number two section. Push it all the way down. And then when it stops, what you need to do then, is just take it and twist it round like you're screwing it on. What this is gonna do is lock it into the correct position so it can't go anymore. It's gonna be at its strongest point. Just make sure, again, if you've got a bit of OCD, line the hole up with your little triangle about right and then all that's left to do now is put your drill bit in and drill your hole okay to make this a bit easier what I do is just put the drill on its side and what that's going to do is create a solid platform for it and then once you start the drill going round, just offer the whole of the piece of plastic up to the drill bit and just apply gentle pressure. Okay, so that's created my six mil hole now. This plastic is really strong, and when the drill bit gets to the point where it's touching the plastic, you'll hear, you'll hear it. 
the sound will change. It will create quite a high pitched sound uh, and that's when you want to stop. So just stop at that point and then all you're going to do is get your black recess again, place that into the hole and just give it a, a gentle twist. Just keep twisting and at this point if it doesn't go in just get your drill and just go back into the hole. Don't don't wiggle it around, which is creating a bigger hole than six mil. There you go, that's that's just popped in now. All I'm gonna do is just keep keep screwing it. And it'll line itself up like that. And what you'll see is it'll sit flush to the plastic plastic tubing. That's your puller fitted. Last thing to do is just place your PTFE bush into the to the hole, slide it in, and there you have your side puller fitted. Just going to test the strength. Absolutely rock solid. I'm just going to fit some elastic into this, and then off fishing we go.